Welcome back to another episode on Beho Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look at an upcoming Japanese RPG no from Bandai Namco, Scarlet Nexus. Right. Seeing the game on a preview list on upcoming games from Xbox games from Japan developers, I will be straight honest that there wasn't much interest for me as it looked very similar to third person RPGs like Fantasy Star Online and God Eater. The similarities were there, but the action was a bit more fast paced variety where it was more frantic. With the demo just released, I decided to take a test drive preview of the game on the Xbox Series X. Scarlet Nexus is developed and will be released by Bandai Namco on June 25th of 2021 for the Xbox One, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series X and S, PlayStation 5, and for Microsoft Windows. The game itself takes the third person action RPG genre and expands on the action part of it with unique set of powers your character will be able to use that truly makes the game that much different. In a world where humanity is protected from the others, which are mindless monsters, the other suppression force, or the OSF, have soldiers with a different abilities and of course telekinesis that allows you to use objects around you to attack the enemy. The story are told with comic book style stills with character faces that do most of the talking during downtime as you are able to choose between two main characters. You have the choice of Japanese or English, but I would suggest English as long as you don't know Japanese as they speak to you during battle and you must read the subtitles for hints and strategies. If you don't understand Japanese, the subtitles are in an area away from the action and really might be confusing. In English, you will get the direction and orders faster without having to decipher what was just said. Sclerokinesis should be effective against that. Oh hell! Should be able to break the outer shell if you keep attacking. The action and gameplay are the best part of the demo that was released. You will fight with two other companions that are able to borrow their special techniques to fight as well. Other techniques are granted to you as you level up and you also are able to use powers like invisibility, slowing down time, able to see invisible enemies, and so much more. Let me borrow this! All these powers and able to throw objects around you at the enemy really changes your fighting style as you don't always need to fight in close encounters. You will lose your telekinesis power bar and need to fight normally to power back up but that uses both mechanics in order to build different combos when in combat. The visuals are nice as well, but nothing here screams next gen. I feel that the best part of the game being played on a Series X or S and the PlayStation 5 will be performance, where I believe this current focus on generational leaps and bounds will truly concentrate on. The game runs smoothly at a 4K and 60 frames per second on my monitor, and probably more as I've seen articles of the game running at 120 frames. 
I'm almost certain that the last gen consoles will probably run at 30 frames per second, while the PS4 Pro and the Xbox One X will have a slight resolution boost and hopefully at 60 frames per second. But if you have an Xbox Series X or S and or the PS5, that is probably the way to go. A game I really thought did not push my attention to the next level really got me looking into this one a lot more as the gameplay and action is really the hero in this game so far. The characters seem similar to other RPGs and hope the story is more developed but I think that the action will take point once the game releases. The levels and maps themselves were okay at best but I do hope when the game releases that we see more fantastic designs and unique art style to help the fantastic gameplay in a more complete game. Scarlet Nexus is indeed a promising game with great responsive action gameplay already right out of the box. Let's hope that the rest of the game follows with better design levels and of course a great story that is a must in any role playing game. That's it for me on this episode on this demo preview look at Scarlet Nexus. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Be ho out and great. Take us out of here, and I will see you all next upload. Yeah, take けなことをするな。自分の見くらい自分で守れる。